in this class we'll be discussing about coulomb's law coulomb's law is actually to calculate the force between the two charges it is given by f is equal to k q1 q2 by r square now let's understand this suppose i have a charge q1 another charge q2 let's say this is an origin let me call this is an origin let me call this as an r1 vector let me call this as an r2 vector let me call this as an r vector then from the triangle of addition as we have already discussed in the previous classes this vector plus this vector would be equal to this vector so which is nothing but r1 vector plus r vector would be equal to r2 vector because r2 vector is the closing side of the triangle so what would be my resultant r vector r vector will be nothing but r2 vector minus r1 vector now one more thing if you have to observe is when you are saying force it would should have a direction because in the initial class itself we have said force is a vectored quantity but if you look here there is no direction because when you push somebody or you pull something it has to be some direction so let me add that direction so it would be given by an r cap and you know that the unit vector is nothing but the vector by the magnitude so my force which has to be a vectored quantity should be k q1 q2 by r square and r cap would be nothing but my r vector by mod r which ultimately comes out to be k q1 q2 by r cube and this should be an r vector now this force can be attractive or can be repulsive it depends on the charges if both are like charges like positive positive it it will be a repulsive if both if one is like another is unlike like plus and minus then it will be attractive we'll be seeing the numerical on coulomb's law in the next videos